Okay, I'm not sure this is gonna work, but we're gonna try and bake some bread. All right, first attempt baking bread in the outdoor kitchen. I don't have any sugar, so I'm using uh, honey. I got these little um, individual use honey package, which are also for camping. Um, so hopefully the yeast won't notice the difference. And there's no way that uh, honey is gonna bring any bears here, so I feel like I'm, I'm safe. But uh, I'm also trying to have the recipe, so I am totally eyeballing everything on this. Uh, that's why I have a good sense this is gonna fail miserably. I will put the, I'll put the original recipe, um, put the original recipe in the comments. Uh, I am totally eyeballing this, so the likelihood that it will fail is very high. But essentially, put about three quarters of a cup of uh, water, hopefully around 110 degrees. Wow, this uh, actually proved, which um, means two things. One, it might actually work, and two, if it doesn't, I can't blame the nice people at Fleischmann's for having bad yeast. So this is, I'm just eyeballing it because, hey, we're in the woods. Adding a little bit of uh, olive oil, if I can get the cap off. Uh, a little bit of olive oil, that'll be fine. Uh, some rosemary. I would normally use fresh, but I don't have any. Um, I was thinking about just chopping up some pine needles, but I don't think that's uh, a good idea either. Some black pepper, because why not? And uh, some salt. There's going to be a lot of salt on the top of it, so you don't have to go too crazy in the bread itself. Um, I'm doing well with what I can. I, I literally, because I forgot um, the camera holder, I have just gorilla taped uh, the camera to the tripod because pretty much everything can be done with Gorilla Tape. I'm going by like feel and touch and sight because I am again having the recipe and not doing it very accurately but I know I've done this bread before like in an actual kitchen and I know what it's supposed to look like so. And now pray to the gods of bread that it shall rise. Come on, baby, do it for me. Check back in an hour and hopefully it has risen. Okay, now the moment of truth. Oh, it rose! Oh, All right, let's do this. What I got here is a Coleman uh, oven. Not too expensive. It folds up into a little flat package and you can essentially uh, bake things in it. I've also tried the Omnia, which is like a Scandinavian oven thing. They all go right on top of like a burner like this. They both work pretty well. Um, I didn't want to bring two, so I kind of left the other one at home because it's, it's an odd ring shape and it works. It works really well actually. Probably sometimes better than this one, but this one's a bit more versatile than the Omnia. Um, they're both good, they both work. Um, but this is my first time actually trying to bake something in this one, so we'll see how that goes. A little olive oil in here. Grease this baby up. Dump it in. Bloop. And I'm just gonna spread it out. So I'm gonna give this another like 20 minutes to rise uh, while this heats up. Sweet. Okay, the oven's heated up. This has risen a bit more. And I'm just gonna make some indentations in it. So it has that focaccia look. And then I'm going to uh, pour a little olive oil in each of the holes. <clears throat> then I'm gonna shake a little more salt over the top. And into the oven it goes. I'm 
still 50 50 this is actually going to work but we'll see also i realize um this is on a bit of an incline i could have done a better job making this level live and learn live and learn this is a little bit ridiculous but i got like a really nice bottle of balsamic vinegar because i wanted to actually use it uh, on the trip like any farm stand tomatoes um, anything like baked like this um, i'm definitely gonna be using it all right i think we are in business check her out okay the moment of truth do this. A little balsamic, a uh, little olive oil. Oh man. <laughs> Bam! That's how you do it, Woods. That's how you do. I think I'm gonna make a soup or a stew tonight. It's getting cold, it's getting down to like 46 degrees tonight, so that'll be good. Tomorrow with some scrambled eggs. Oh, yeah, yeah! Mm. Georgia, yeah! Focaccia, Georgia! Focaccia! She's looking at me like I'm a crazy person. Probably because I'm a crazy person. It's all right, I'm okay, I'm okay. First bread, first camping bread is a win. Oh, I have some more of that.